down at the river. As you can see, it's sunny, but it's not foggy, but it's like kind of burning off the uh, whatever moisture in there. But all right, we're down at the river. Let's see what we find. Let's see if it's fine. Tile day. This one's tiny. Keep on, keep on. Right. Tin button number two. Is that a white one? It looks like the same. Alright, something's sticking out, guys. Alright, guys, here's that piece I pulled out. It's cake and like tarish stuff. I don't know if it's too old, but it's a cool color, so I might save it. Is that our first one? Yeah, from all Russian California, what they did, they went out there and threw gold that they had made. Gold comes more in the ore oh, than it does in a solid piece, you understand? I just picked up this cool piece of texture glass. Pretty thin, very light. Let's see what this is. Obviously, it's a piece of electronic or something. Huh? Oh, trash. Let's see something here. Let's just see what it is. It might not be anything. Oh, fuck, I'm fall in the water. Oh, it's like weird rock. All right. Here we have a top of milk bottle. Um, I find a lot of these, well not full ones, but broken ones. And a lot of the bases uh, in this area. Uh, kind of looks like it has a pinkish. Eh, I think it's clear. But that it looks out. like a belt. Oh, that's stuck. But that looks like a belt. I kind of want the belt. Okay, well we got the uh, buckle out. And it has some... Oh, it says Jasmine. Yeah. That's okay. That's gonna stay here. Right, see that up there? Let's see, guys. It might be plastic, but. That's pretty cool. Waterman's ink. Actually, we're gonna keep that. It'll be a top from an inkwell. That's pretty cool. Did you look at that? Belts number two. find the day but button number all right three. everyone that's the hunt not too bad stay tuned for the wrap-up all right everyone that time again just a quick uh, wrap-up as you can see wasn't uh, I didn't take too many finds with me the tiles I keep a couple here and there if the tiny ones have a color or something but for the most part I leave them there but uh, let's go through just a quick what I found and then we'll get to uh, the cap I actually did a little research and uh, we'll give, I'll give you a quick uh, rundown. These two pennies I found by uh, the city bike, uh, the docks. Pretty cool. Uh, here's, we'll just go with this piece again. It's pretty, it feels pretty recent, so I don't know what that could have been. Three buttons, all different. This one looks like it has some sort of pattern. Maybe not. Maybe it's just chip. But three buttons. Those will go in to uh, my bottle. Uh, either I posted that video or you'll see it soon. Uh, here's just that cool piece of turquoise aquamarine color. And then the three finds of the day. We'll start with the marble. This is just has so many colors to it. Let's see if we can get it into the light. There it is. Got some reddish orangish, yellow, white, green. Pretty cool. And then we have this piece of pottery with a really nice design, floral design. Maybe a teacup or something, but we got, it looks like a leaf, maybe some flowers. And then the last find, as you saw, was this Waterman's ink. And then over there it would say ideal. 
I will then turn to remove. So I did a little research and this would have been on top of a cork, I think. And then that cork would have went into the ink bottle. Um, this is made out of bake light, bake light apologies. Uh, I think which was invented in New York in uh, 1907, I believe. Um, but yeah, so pretty cool bake light. I don't know if this could be my first piece of like bake light that I've actually been able to identify as bake light. So now that's good to just know it for future. I'm pretty sure I've actually found other pieces of bake light now that I'm feeling this. But anyways, yeah, this is uh, circa 1920s. So that's a pretty cool find. My first one of these. So yeah, quick hunt. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next video. And uh, for any of my fellow um, members of the tribe out there, I want to wish you all a, a happy Passover. And then uh, to everyone else, uh, happy future Easter. And uh, thanks for watching. Beep, beep.